don't you have a life? And also, I don't know why you're so obsessed with me. <laughs> uh, it's a quality scenario. God rest fucking Frank's soul. And um, do you know what? In that interview, we've been through it time and time again. A couple of things have come to light since the uh, last revisit, the last stroll down uh, memory lane there, Frank McCourt Lane, the Angel of the Lanes. Number one is that the channel which hosted the original video has been taken down due to copyright or something. Now, whatever you may think about that uh, is by the by, because what happened with that channel, Killian M2, is that it, it highlighted a service. Killian M2's channel now highlighted a service which is not being provided from the very people who take the money out of the hands of the people who avail of the service. And it's coercive as well. You're not, yeah, you will go to jail, they tell you in the ads, if you don't pay this fucking thing. And what he did was he had a load of fucking videos of old stuff, stuff that you paid for. Remember that now, when you hopefully now take this as upon yourselves to write numerous emails or whatever the fuck, might be just pissing in the wind to RTE. Uh, we pay for that fucking service and I think it's a damn fucking liberty that we should have to not be allowed to watch the stuff back again do you get me Thanks for the you, yeah they've got a, what they've got a curated archive channel what a load of bollocks that is they're, they're handpicking a load of stuff and then they're throwing the stuff away that they don't want you to see mm. prime time example was the fucking P. Flynn interview which was so Thanks hideously the removed from their own archive channel they had it up they had it up there for years. And then when it had a resurgence in popularity, I, d I don't know why, don't know why that was. I wonder who could have, who could have uh, hammered that clip so much that it got a load of fucking popularity. Anyway, once that got that popularity, it got taken down. Because I reckon that someone, I'm not going to name names here, but, uh, but, uh, but uh, you know, someone fucking got onto RTE and said, you greatly disenhanced my reputation. And then it just went bye-bye. I, uh, so this is the crack. It's, uh, it's, it's not the olden days anymore. They have all that stuff there. We've paid for it. We own the fucking stuff. It's ours. We should be able to see it. Host it even on your own site even. Just let us be able to access the fucking stuff. Do you understand? Because you're pulling... This is just old... The same old shenanigans that where we've been fobbed off time and time again. You're going to put us in prison for what? For, for not paying the fucking thing that we're not even allowed to watch again? Absolute cack. And then they have the indignity and indecency to fucking throw us... A, a, a web player that was that's being made by... Who the fuck made that? Who made that web player? It doesn't even work properly. And then you're watching, I was watching one of the Euro games and it cut out during the fucking penalties in one of the matches. I know it wasn't the, the final, but a load of games went to penalties. And that's not, not even to count the amount of times that has gone tits up during, uh, you know, the All-Ireland or something like that. That's happened a few times as well. It's, they can't say that uh, it's an overload of the server or something like that. Not in this day and age. It's, that's time is up. The, the the time you've had enough time now. You've had enough time. I think that's a point. Look, I don't really get that annoyed about stuff, but I think it's a point. They 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 fucking got rid of the, some of the funniest fucking shit I've seen in a long time. And then I seen Tipperary and who is a, a supporter of the the chat and the the stream. He has gone on his own steam and he's uploaded, he's re-uploaded the Frank McCourt, he's re-uploaded um, a couple of things. It'll be only a matter of time before it's taken down again. And the ones that he's re-uploaded, they've, they've come from somewhere else, they're not even as good quality as the ones. Sorry, I'm not, not saying that shit, Tipperary, it's, you've done a great job, but it's a fucking shame that they've taken the stuff down. Do public bro broadcasters own that stuff, do they? Or do we, the people who pay for it, own it or what? Fucking joke, man. Thanks for the tip. Like, I I am serious. That clip got that clip got me out of some. Not, 
I wouldn't say it got me out of hard times, but there were times when I wasn't fucking feeling happy, but I watched it. It was fucking hilarious. And uh, the, the prospect of being able to go down memory lane again and again with loads of different other shit was... Uh, it was keep it was it was in the back of the fucking head and I thought, yeah, well at least there's that, do you know? Anyway. Too much. Too much.